Hello everybody. How is your mood? Are you ready? Okay, let's start our English lesson, lesson number four, the motto number one, our world. The theme of our lesson, pollution and the environment. The aims of this lesson to explore reasons for the appearance of environmental problems and to find solutions to exciting and propose ways out of this situation. Everybody knows that our environment today is in danger, but very few people want to know why and how to cope with this problem. Today we try to find the solution of this problem too. Urban Urban Sewerage system Sewerage system Green Green Nature reserve Nature reserve Fossil fuels Fossil fuels Smog Smog Global warming, global warming, greenhouse effect, greenhouse effect, rural, rural, endangered species, endangered species, go off, go off, die out, die out, Run out of. Run out of. Give off. Give off. Cut down. Cut down. Bring out. Bring out. Clear up. Clear up. Throw away. Throw away. Global warming is the rise in temperature in many parts of the world and it causes changes in weather. Endangered species could die out very soon. Rural problems are related to the countryside, the opposite are urban problems and they're the problems related to cities and towns. Things that are green are not bad for the environment. The greenhouse effect causes that the sun's heat cannot escape into the space and the earth is getting warmer. Smog is a mixture of smoke and fog which hangs over a city. The sewerage system is the pipes and facilities that take dirty water from homes and factories. A nature reserve is a place where wild animals and plants are protected. Coal, gas and oil are fossil fuels. My dears, answer my questions please. Do you throw away or reuse plastic bags? Yes or no? Which is the most dangerous to destroy? How do you think? How can you reduce waste in your home? What things are harmful to the environment in your home? Area. Various forms of pollution are happening due to some careless human actions. For example, there are air pollution, water pollution, soil pollution, and radioactive pollution. Every year, millions of chemicals are thrown into water and air. 
because we get dirty seas and oceans where even fishes die out and gas polluted air which is cause of many health problems. Filtering is one of them. It can lead to water and air pollution, land and soil pollution, and too many other unwanted effects. Filter has become a serious environmental issue nowadays. When I hear a word litter, I imagine what? Old clothes, old things, disposable products, and old furniture. What is the solution for environmental pollution? How do you think? Yes, of course. The most basic solution for air pollution is to move away from fossil fuels, replacing them with alternative energies like solar and wind. Producing clean energy is crucial, but equally important is to reduce our consumption of energy by adopting responsible habits and using more efficient devices. How do we solve the pollution problem? At first, reduce or eliminate fireplace and wood stuff use. Avoid burning leaves, trash and other materials. Avoid using gas powered lawn and garden equipment. Okay, boys and girls, take your pants and we shall have a test. So first, what does your family do with empty bottles? A. Take them to a recycling center. B. Return them to the supermarket. And C. Throw them to the rubbish bin. Number two, do you use water-based cleaning products to clean your house? A. I don't check. B. I try to. And C. Always. Number three, how often do you use insect sprays? A. Never. B. Always and C. Seldom. If we are asked to contribute to save the animal project, you would A. Give generously B. Give a small amount and C. Refuse to give anything. Number 5. A local beach has been polluted with oil. You A. Donate money for the cleanup project. B. Do nothing. And C. Volunteer to help with the cleanup project. Number 6. You eat a chocolate bar in the street. What do you do with it? Wrapper. A. Drop it on the pavement. B. Put it in a little bin. C. Save it for recycling. The seventh question. Do you ever enjoy light meals that require little or no cooking like salad? A. Not very often. B. Often. And C. Sometimes. Eight. 
When you clean your teeth, you A. Turn the tap on only when you need water. B. Leave the tap running until you have finished. And C. Only use one glass of water. Okay, let's finish and count your results. 1824. Keep up the good work. You are doing your part to protect the environment. 1317. There is some room for improvement. Change your habits and soon you will be green. 012. You are part of the problem. You should try to become part of the solution. 012. Let's conclude our lesson. You know that pollution is a big problem that faces the world. If we want to live in a better and healthier world, we should take great care of our nature and learn to protect it. Okay, and now open your notebooks and write down our home task. Exercise 3 at page 10. Complete the sentences with the words in the box. For example, poison pollutes, destroy, waste, burn, save, reuse, and recycle. For example, it's important to recycle more paper and glass. Okay, our lesson is over. Goodbye. Thank you for your attention.